Let's get salty! Everyone, Zeddy here again today with a brand new gameplay video, and I have Legend today in Wild playing everybody's favorite super toxic unfun deck that Blizzard needs to delete already because this expansion, it got even more toxic. We play now Renethal Reno. You get that tag in the extra elf, and then you've got now the Galactic Projection Orb, which is another way of casting Time Warp, which you can recast with the Gray Sage Parrot, which you can go, uh, you can get Potion of Illusion and recast it. You can also go Infinite with Potion of Illusion, as well as Parrot and Romath. So you have all these ways of recasting it you have reno lone ranger which is busted you have reno itself and it's just a disgusting disgusting deck that really needs to see time warp go to once per game but you'll note in the games i played today i think i only won or the games i'm highlighting i think only one i took multiple turns and it can win by other means you'll see but of course solid alibi objection ice play it's just a super toxic deck but for some reason i've always really enjoyed playing quest mage I, I i've got thousands of games of it and yeah i hit legend with it again so um if you want to see some absolutely horrible toxic wild gameplay enjoy and hopefully blizzard eventually one day gives that stupid time warp to say once per game anyways if you enjoyed the video please like and subscribe have a great day and stay salty my friends demon hunter you don't see that a lot in wild i'm guessing quest line i would think it could be odd dh i guess i've seen some odd i, I haven't seen it but i've heard of odd dh running um umpire's grasp and uh window shopper but looks like it's quest line so we're gonna get like glided and shenanigans like that most likely not a great hand to start and yes we are playing the most toxic deck in wild i don't know i've always had a thing for quest page i've always liked playing it but i've always advocated for it being like deleted from the game it's so unhealthy it's so not good for the game you know i would love to see the reward Take an extra turn once per game. I know, right? What a concept, but um, yeah, I don't know. Wild doesn't get a lot of love in that regard. This wild meta, I have to say, is one of my least favorite ever. Like it's the rogues that kill you on turn five, uh, super aggressive uh, aggro priests that take extra turns. It's just like not the most fun experience in the world to say the least, but when is Hearthstone ever really that fun? <laughs> You know, it's kind of common, so. Anyways, um, honestly, I think I'm gonna just get another coin. Actually, do I do that? Uh, I guess I si I don't like wasting mana, especially they glide you, it's just Taj. I'm gonna get an extra coin. Just because the coin's never that bad. I think that's the play, I don't know. We take this because it can give us some body presence. It can hit us in the face, depending on how things go. But yeah, they I, I wish they never reverted this quest line for a while, but it's not even that big a prominent threat. It's every deck is so toxic and wild. Like uh, the best place to play wild, I have to say, never rank up in wild. Just play like low ranks, try and dumpster MMR and try and face people actually not playing quest mage and stuff like that but yeah if you want to climb the ranks play competitively get to legend these are the type of decks you got to play or at least typically it's it's sad but that's just the way it is right when you have a format that has every card in hearthstone i think i don't know if there's currently a banned card i'd have to think about that i don't know if there was a card banned in last year's so we had like switcheroo and tome tampering brought back I'm not sure on that one. Anyways, um, when you have like every card ever and um, you never do balance changes, it's just, it's just going to be what happens, right? Yeah. I guess I coin this out or I just play this. So the problem I have, they glide me. They might not run glide. Some lists don't run glide. They glide me and then I have dupes in my deck. I'd love to be able to coin coin Reno at some point, so I'm gonna hope that they don't have um they don't have glide. That that's like but yeah, they they glide me. I'm gonna have two coins in my deck almost certainly. Highlander stuff is shut off. 
we don't have block or anything. We probably get glided, right? And we just lose. Yeah, of course. Very, like, the cards of Wild are just so toxic. Everything. What I'm playing, what they're playing. Anti-fun is what I like to call Wild most of the time. It's just awful. Like, I can't even play the game no mana, but I'm trying to make it so he can't play the game and uh, never has another turn. So yeah, our dupes are, are uh, we have two coins in the dock, so if we draw one, we can play Highlander cards, but yeah, until then, we're in this spot. Alright, we got a spell for our thing. This has Rush. This clogs my hand. Does give me stuff to play, to be fair. All right, well, maybe the taunts are relevant. We'll see. But yeah, I don't know. I got to coin the fell spell, but I don't think it was most likely worth. So you got Parrot, which can recast this. So he's already quest complete on turn six. So that's always good. That's always a good thing. All right, well, we're going to devolve this. We're going to get our uh, our potion going. And we're going to need to have a really good evocation, I think. Because, yeah, every card they pl play now is cost two less, so they can just rip through their deck, basically. And our quest is at two of eight. Two of eight. Not ideal. And um, if we can ETC this, or we can yoink this, we probably do that just to get like Frost Nova. Try and stay alive. It's also another spell. I could freeze their face. That's also a line. They don't hate it. Yeah, let's do that. So they can't draw as many cards, hopefully. And if these live, I can uh, get another one in Nova. Because I don't think this deck kills you from in hand, but I mean, they probably have what you call it tog woggle i don't know what the win con is other than maybe stats i don't know what they're playing oh no just another glide very fun very fun i'm having a great time against one of my least favorite i mean i just hate stormwind you, you guys know i i love stormwind everything about stormwind is just awful and this deck just does not make me feel good at all and uh, I truly believe Hearthstone would be a better game if Stormwind was not in it. No one will ever convince me otherwise. So next turn, they can uh, draw a billion cards. We got Romath. They have a billion stats. All right, let's uh, see what we can do here. Objection, I suppose, even though I already had one, but it's just a broken card. We're gonna go here. Do I ping? Let's think about this. Um, if I ping, I damage that more, but I need to kill that. So let's just do this. All right, so spell wise, I'm not even close. <laughs> I don't know how I get there. We're gonna try. This I can just play, but I don't really get much. I potion it. I do get another one. I just wish, now I wish I took the Frost Nova. Cause I could have just like infinitely frozen the board. It's unfortunate. But yeah, they're, all their cards are like zero mana. Not a lot we can do. But at least we, we deleted one of them, I suppose. He'll cast Objection, he'll Potion himself, he'll freeze one thing. We get a couple coin. No, we, I didn't play the coins. I, I get a Rewind and a coin. Oh no, I, I don't get the Rewind because that started in my deck. 
Yeah, still, uh, still not spending any mana. Seems about right. Still, uh, has seven mana. He's played, like, 30 cards this turn. Pretty good stuff. I did play a coin, so I'll be able to play the one mana one, I guess. And just try and freeze infinitely. I think that's the line. Because this is not very active. Because, like, I, I potion it. And it freezes an enemy. I also get whatever this will be. But yeah, I can just freeze infinitely here. So we might be able to stabilize with this stupid... <laughs> no, no need for the quest, just... Try and lock it down this way. Ooh, we got flint. That's pretty good. Don't think too hard. And I think we just spam these until everything's frozen. <laughs> this is a weird way to play it, but uh, we're going for it. Not toxic at all, by the way. What is this? Oh, valet. Okay. I don't know if it's... It's not guaranteed to freeze. But uh, we'll do this. We'll play a taunt. Alright. Well, that's one way of going about this. We got Millhouse! His cards cost nothing anyways. So the question is, does he have, like, Togwoggle to kill me now? I mean, he can get my deck, right? I think. But this is <laughs> wild is so wrong. Everything about wild is a problem. Wait, if he plays Tog, my Zeph is active though. That would be good for me. That wouldn't even be bad. Who's hiding now? Right? Like, oh my god. Who's what is wrong with Hearthstone? Sorry, it's just wild. Wild is just. It's something. I mean, it's probably fine to watch, just <laughs> never recommend playing it. Oh my goodness. It's gotta be Tog, right? Or something? No? Alright. Um... Do I just flint here? I don't think I have lethal. Let's, let's flint. Let's see what happens. Might screw with my guy a little bit, I guess. I don't know. Um, I don't... Well, that's that's pretty useless. Okay, so that was a complete waste. Um... Well, let's kill this. We're, we're gonna hit face. And just start playing these, I suppose? Although now this flint's kind of annoying. Do I have regrets? Maybe. But I always get the uh, Romath first, anyways. Well, not always. But quite often. Um, this <laughs> They've had enough! How stupid is that game? There we go! That's how you beat him. Who needs the quest? Just infinite Romaths! Alright, so my guess, Shadow Priest is the most common thing. Devolving Missiles, I think, is a must to keep. I think. Um, but Shadow Priest is very common. You have the Inner Fire Priest, of course. We highlighted that one already. Um, but yeah, Shadow Priest can just smork us, plus take an extra turn. I'm glad this deck does have significant weaknesses. I don't think it's the best deck in Wild, by, not by a mile. But it, I'd argue this is the most toxic deck in Wild. I'd definitely make that argument. Starting the operation. But, uh, I mean, they're all pretty toxic. Why Why does that have three health or whatever health? Um, I guess I just tempo this. Reality. And we hope that we hit this. All right. Unfortunately, we didn't hit this, but we took off the three damage, which is relevant. But yeah, the stack is, as we highlighted before, is absolutely disgusting. And that's the most broken card in the deck. 
You just auto lose to that most of the time. Because raid leader that also goes face needs to be one mana with three health. <laughs> it's pretty messed up stuff, but again, like I've been saying, everything in wild is pretty messed up. To say the least. I don't know if this is running dragons or just pure aggro. I have no idea here. I mean, this seems incorrect, but we'll take it. So I could coin Reno and then probably die the turn after. <laughs> That's probably what's going to happen here. We have no answers, but again, uh, this deck does not fare super well against super hyper aggro. If you can stabilize, you win, but trying to stabilize against this is not easy. I mean, if that's their only turn, that's pretty good for us. Well, I mean, we're going to Reno here. We gain 25 health. It's a 4-6 on, on the board. But, uh, yeah, when Reno is basically just a tempo card here, and I'm not in a good spot still. All right, so it's definitely the Zerimi. They're probably, yeah, they're playing enough dragons that this is going to be active. If they go all face, though, we can punish. Kind of? Hearthstone balance. It exists, just not on this planet. Alright, so that has to die. And we get another Reno, but, like, it's not doing a lot. We have no cards. We're probably going to Reno next turn and Finley for, like, a card. And they can also take an extra turn. Although they've only played, uh... One, two, two dragons so far. Only two dragons so far. So yeah, this is uh, looking rough. Just, just to say the least, but... I mean, I think we get the other Reno. We're... That was bad ordering, too. If we get the other arena, we're probably fine. But the likelihood of that is going to be, like, zero, so... But yeah, I think they could have proc'd me, and of course they messed up. But it's aggro decks, right? They're the hardest to play in Hearthstone. Um, alright, so we're going to draw first. So I could freeze the board. They still probably proc me. It's possible they don't. They've used double mines here, but like mind blast, all that stuff. What to do? I think we want to save it for next turn. So I'm just gonna put this at the face, I guess. It doesn't really matter. They're gonna proc me regardless. All right, coins can be all right. So the the idea is actually they're not gonna be board locks location. But again, they haven't played enough pirates. If they have a tech card for ice block, then they win. I can't beat that. The idea is we're going to play Reno. We're going to freeze the board, and then we're going to flip. I think that's the line. But yeah, pretty rough stuff. Uh, top decks we can get to possibly win are like Zeph, uh, Reno Lone Ranger. What's our quest at? We're not very close. But something along those lines. Don't have a lot of board clears. Varden can help us a little bit. Yeah, I mean, if they run Ashen Elemental, Tight Lit Witness. I've seen all the techs. I've been beaten by all of them. I'm accustomed to them at this point. All right, I mean, this adds a card to my hand, so I don't mind playing it. I'm I have to play one coin. Um, man, I wish I didn't run the 10 mana card. Um, switcheroo. I think I just take capture cold tooth mine. It's not guaranteed to hit stuff, but anyways, we got a Reno. We always do that. We know we got to do that. We're going to draw the lowest cost card in our deck. If it's evocation, that's great. Okay, that's great. Because now we can go coin, coin, evocation. Um, any of these I would like to play. Glyph, possibly. 
Oh, I meant to freeze the board. This is a mistake. Okay, this was a horrible mistake. I messed up huge. Okay, I have to deviate now. That was a huge mistake. Yeah, the idea was I was going to freeze the board and flip, but I spent the mana. I, I needed one more mana. That was a huge mistake. That probably cost me the game. But deserved. Deserved. I mean, could still get Reno or something. But yeah, that was brutal. All right, I got I got to flip. I just brain farted. Oh, not punished at all. Beautiful. Not punished. We got Reno Lone Ranger. It's probably still winnable for them, but it's going to be pretty tough and they can't develop and I'm at 45 health. And I can complete my quest next turn. That was horribly played by me. So, you know, naturally we'll be punished, right? Naturally. That's how Hearthstone works. You play bad, you lose, right? In a matchup I'm unfavored against? I'm sure that will happen. Naturally. Oh lord. What have I done? So we finlay those cards to the bottom. We know that Orb and Romath are not in the bottom. We don't necessarily need those cards to win. Against aggro decks, you just typically need to stabilize and then win, but we'll see. We have um, Ajara, which I'd love to do with for another turn, but I'd probably just go for like a Colossal or something. Something like that. Are they tilted and rage quitting? I would be. I'd be frustrated. <laughs> but, you know, and, you, and you're playing this deck mostly just to beat the deck I'm playing. Like you're so frustrated by Quest Mage existing, which how has it been allowed to exist in the state for so long? And as someone who has played it more than almost anybody, I have complained about it more than like anybody. But I do enjoy playing it. I have to say, I enjoy playing it. So, um, there's Romath. So I guess we just win. Uh, card draw. Car it costs one. This costs. So that's one, two, three, and I can play the reward. I same with card draw. I think the card draw is more valuable. Um, this is better because I get a body on the board and I get the coin going. Yeah, I played this game really poorly and, um, looks like we're probably, yeah, we're going to win probably. Although, um, I don't get infinite turns here, but it should be enough that we're good to go. I'll get the coin as well. I'll get card draw. I mean, they're just dead on board. Eight, ten. Oh, I just need to put a damage on the board. We have long now we rise. Just need to put some damage on the board. So this is a game where, uh, you know, if I just took one extra turn, I would still win. Like, the, I think the deck could still be competitive. I really do. But... It'd be a lot more, f like, fair, which would probably make it unplayable, right? But, yeah, two games in a row we won wasn't because of an infinite time time warp. One with a really weird Demon Hunter interaction, like the, the Demon Hunter game just looping Romath. This game, just the tempo swing, uh, playing like crap, top decking Reno and then going in there and... Well, let's try final boss. Let's let's go. Everybody's favorite matchup, the Quest Mage Mirror. I actually find I fare really, really bad in the mirror. I, I, it's not very skill heavy. It's just tr draws better. I'd say 99% of the time. Who gets the uh, the the quest done the fastest? Who gets the uh, what the the Naga? Oh, it's not Quest Mage. Okay, Secret Mage can be very difficult. I'm very curious what this will be. This is a more automatically a much more honorable mage player. They're not playing the quest, but you know what I'm going to do anyways? I'm going to complain. 
Gold Panther, Baroque, and see that I can play no matter what they play. It doesn't matter. But yeah, what's well, just evolving? Not deal with that. So Gold Panther makes me think they're not Renathal. What? They're gonna be some Reno deck or some combo deck? I wonder. All right, let's do this. See what we got. Double objection. I mean, you always take the objection. God, this deck is just like Lyph. It might be better, but like it, it's just objection because it's just toxic. You just pick the toxic card, and it's always the correct pick. It's not okay, man. All right. Well, that could be anything. All right, let's test with this. Let's throw this. If it's a counter spell, a uh, mana bind, sure. All right, so she's active already. I guess it's like pocket, maybe pocket, pocket mage. So R Lotheb is what we're probably the most afraid of. Big spell mage in this economy? Oh my God. That is some Giga Chad stuff. Big smell. Dude, if they play Belinda into this, they're going to be very upset. So we take this one so we can get another quest, hopefully. Or just another glyph, another objection, something toxic. Yeah, they Belinda into this. This is going to be um really not OK. <laughs> like really like just disgusting. Don't do it. Okay. This is some jank. They played around objection. They're sniping. I'm not streaming, but they're sniping. I'm not okay with this. All right. That could be their own. Dude, why does objection exist forever? It exists forever in wild. How messed is that? All right, we play another objection. They need another minion to test for it. I, I mean, I might just play another one. So potion hard run. It's got to be pocket, right? No, no, it's, I'm so confused. I'm rooting for activate. I mean, even though it's my final boss, I'm rooting for them. I hope they win. It, I want in the comments down below. I want you guys rooting for activate to beat this toxic garbage. Okay, it's gotta be like a Reno deck. They're hard running Blizzard. It's gotta be something like that. All right, glyph me. Tear reality. That helps me get my quest done, but it also is bad with Romath. But I think I just take it. And hopefully they're not completely useless. They are certainly not useless. Our hand is gonna be very full though for Romath and stuff, so that's something we'll definitely have to be wary of. Take Counterspell. Take Runes. Take the Toxic cards. Alright, so our quest is done. We can play two in a row. We don't know what the secret is. It can be anything. I might get Reno Lone Ranger here. But yeah, next turn I can just play Runes, Quest Reward. And then we have another quest. And then, yeah, we go from there. That costs Blizzard, I think, and that's it. And Potion, and he gets another Totem, which he can play. But, yeah, pretty pretty weak um, Dawn Grasp. Pretty weak Dawn Grasp. I, I just want to know what Activate is cooking. What are they cooking? All right, so let's get the runes. We get an extra turn here. So our our girl will get unfrozen. I can Reno Lone Ranger their totem. It's a threat. It's a threat. So let's time warp. I am concerned about objection. I kind of want to flip this hand though. Like, I, I don't think I need any of this at the moment. 
But if it's objection, am I that sad? I don't think so. Okay, it was objection. It was objection. Maybe I am sad about that. But I feel like I don't throw the parrot because it's all my mana. But yeah, I don't really have much of a follow here. We'll kill the totem. Like I said, it's a threat. Here we got Caligos. See what we get from that. I have no max. I could just trade this or just... I think I just trade it. I don't think we're going for um, board presence. Although, they're a Reno deck. They just poof it, I think. But yeah, screw it. Let's do it. Scaled Nightmare. And uh, Evasive. And we just hope they don't have the Arena. I probably should have just traded it. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to throw for Activate, okay? But then I won't upload the game if I lose. Maybe, maybe I'll throw it on if I lose. And then I'll just, I'll let you guys know if I got Legend later. How about that? That's the deal. This game goes up regardless. So you don't know the result. Now you don't know the result if you stuck through this toxic, toxic gameplay. Oh, that's, that's unfortunate. That's, okay, they do have an answer. Dragon's Fury, eh? All right, so if we just get Orb, we win. Romath, we win. Uh, that does not help us win. I could play this, but I think I hold it for, um... I hold it for if they get Reno and then I just redevelop with some random dragons. We're going for the Tempa. The Tempa lines here, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, that casts Blizzard. Potion. And that's it. So their hand is terrible. And they lose. GG. Well, I'm sorry, Activate. My deck is too toxic. I don't know what else to say, my friend. Can we get some Fs in chat for Activate or uh, in my comments for Activate? Unfortunate, but yes, this deck still very legend capable. Blizzard, please delete it. But um, he's already conceded, but I have to wait through the animations of this toxic nonsense. <laughs> I can't play cards. And so how you know they've conceded. That's one thing. Uh, you play this deck, you got to watch yourself be terrible. But let's see. Let's see what our legend rank is. And uh, we got to get that standard legend done. So uh, stay tuned. We'll have some more standard videos pretty darn soon. 1268. I don't deserve it.